Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, Rackers here, and this is episode 31 of Burton Albion Career Mode. Before we go into today's episode, I'm just going to talk to you about the plan for this week's episode. I'm going to be doing one game per episode, just because of my time constraints, I haven't got a lot of time, so I need to be able to get all these videos done. I still want to give you three episodes of Burton Albion Career Mode on just one video, so I'm going to do all three episodes in one sitting, but one game per episode. And if you look on the screen now, it kind of works out all right because we've got Huddersfield today. On Wednesday, we're going to have Newcastle, and on Friday, we've got Aston Villa. So we've got two big games. Maybe I can do something a little bit more feature length with those, give you a bit more insight, show you a bit more of the game. We'll see how that goes, obviously, when I record them and see how it goes with the editing, but obviously. With the amount of time I've got and remaining this weekend, I can't get two episodes done. I just physically do not have the time. So I apologise for that. Hope you understand and I still want to carry on with this career mode. Speaking of that, if you are enjoying this career mode and enjoying the channel, hit that like button. If you're not subscribed, then hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell next week. You're notified every single time a video of mine goes live. Comment Any comments, concerns or improvements, leave them in the comments down below. Hit the eye in the top right hand corner and see a link for, a, for the playlist. Love to keep doing this. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Now let's go into lineup for the Huddersfield game. And this is the lineup for the Huddersfield game, rotating some of the players because of the Newcastle game next episode. But still a strong lineup. We've got Varney and Sparrow up top, Azevedo, Murphy, Riley, and Aikens across the middle, Delaney, Flanagan, McFasden, Brayford across the back, and White, who has now reached 70 in goal. See Sparrow. Can he get the pass off again? Riley. Riley into the box. Riley with his right foot. Ooh, with the forearm from Ward. Riley, I don't know if he was on his weaker foot, but he manages to wriggle out of his way to defenders, shoots it. And, well, it's off more of the shoulder of the keeper, but that's a good start. Good tackle from Flanagan. Scannell back to Naki Wells and to Scannell again. McFaster, big tackle. Big tackle. Varney over the top for Hugo Azevedo. Hugo cuts inside your man. Back post looking for... Oh, Spara! Hogg puts the... Mm, you lucky bugger, Hogg's back. Going to try to dink in towards the back post now. Smith, head, head up and Murphy finishes it. Takes advantage of some really dodgy animations there. We get the look of FIFA in that one. Ball goes up and then the keeper trips over their defender and allows Murphy to just slot it in. Murphy tries to find Azevedo, found him. Azevedo cuts back outside, gets the SEA. Hugo Azevedo shoots! Just wide. Is, he getting, is Palmer going to shoot? Right, they've called another man. Are they going to do the run over pass? He's shot and he's over. Right, we're aiming for O'Grady. O'Grady win the flick. Match. Or just don't go for the ball at all. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Chairs just creep like anything. And we've won the game 1-0. And we had the opportunity. Ten shots to their four. It felt like in the second half they were really putting the pressure on. Aikens with the man of the match. Who was our goal scorer? I forget. Oh, it was Murphy, wasn't it? Yeah, with the luck. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> we finally had a bit of luck. Right, it's the end of the episode. I know you usually do the league table at the end of the week, but I want to set the stage for the rest of the week, right? We have got Aston Villa and Newcastle in the next two games. Top of the table, Newcastle. We are currently 10 points behind them. And then Aston Villa, we are currently eight points behind them. I think now, with being 15 points clear in Nottingham Forest, these are two wins with the, the six, the, the seven games remaining. I honestly think we'll be safe, but we'll see. It's going to be tight. So thank you so much for watching this episode of Burton, Burton Albion Career Mode. Hope you've enjoyed it. Sorry it's a bit shorter than usual, but this is just what I've got to deal with. Join me next episode for the game against Newcastle. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. If you've got any comments, concerns, or feedback, leave it in the comments down below. Remember to check the playlist if you've missed any of the episodes. I've been Rackers, and I'll see you on the next one. Try.